Morning friends, Scott Brookins here. Just uh, wanted to give you an, a message before Christmas uh, coming up in a few days. I wish everyone a, a very Merry Christmas, you and your family. Um, I hope you're just going to have a great time and kind of I was thinking the, this morning during my prayer time of kind of what's the best Christmas ever and um, you know kind of going back in my mind you know maybe we think of when we're little um, maybe a certain toy that we wanted and, and got at Christmas time maybe you know it was under the tree or as a gift from one of our relatives um, but you know probably the most important memories that we have are not of things right um, it's not of what we received sometimes it's what we gave you know the joy of giving to someone else like I shared in a different message but also usually it's it's about the people you know it's about the family and friends that are around us um, you know maybe it was the first Christmas you had when you were married you know as a married couple or first Christmas you had with your first child or your second child or all of you know their first Christmases you know I remember when our son our first Christmas his first Christmas um, he was in the hospital um, you know he had some uh, severe croup and um, we had to rush him to emergency in the middle of the night one night a couple days before Christmas and so he spent a few, several days and Laura slept in the hospital room with him as he was in a kind of a tent you know with oxygen and so forth and we brought him home the day of Christmas I think it was and boy that was just a joyful celebration that he was alive he was doing great and we could celebrate um, just the three of us, you know, with nothing else, with no toys, no gifts, just that he was alive and we had that gift from God. Or, you know, maybe um, you, th you can think of different things in your families that you've had different fun celebrations. Maybe you've gone to on a vacation or, or you know, had a special ceremony or special church service. So I want to encourage us in this short message just to have this Christmas be the best Christmas ever and not with not not with presents not with pressure not with um, oh what am I gonna do uh, just to relax and enjoy our family our friends uh, the people around us and make this the best Christmas so that next year we can remember you know we had a great time last year but what was it it was celebrating together as a family celebrating that God loved us so much that he came from heaven to earth for, for us you know, the Bible tells us that even though we are in our sin, God loved us so much that Jesus came and, and came as a baby to, to, to grow as a human and to be part man, part God, and understand exactly what we go through. And then he died for our sins. And so we can celebrate that. The only religion in the world where God came to us. We don't have to work our way to God. We can't work our way to God. It's all about God's love and about his grace that he gives us when we give our lives to him. So I hope you like and enjoy this uh, message. Share it. Um, just remember in your own lives what's the best Christmas ever and make this one a memorable one, not because of the gifts and the material th possessions that we have and the blessings that we have in that way, but just that we celebrate the time together. And I hope that you worship God. I hope you go to church and have a great celebration on Christmas Eve or Christmas morning celebrating the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So go have an amazing day, have an amazing Christmas in a few days, and inspire someone else to do the same. God bless.